All right, guys, this is tomorrow's workout. So um, those of you that participated in the Zoom Saturday, it was a lot of fun, it was great. And we're gonna actually do it again tomorrow. So tomorrow morning at 8 a.m., if you're available, join us, okay? We'll send out a link for the Zoom again, just like we did last time. Um, and yeah, if you're free at 8 a.m. tomorrow, Nancy and I are gonna do this workout with you guys right here in the gym, okay? So tomorrow's workout, think of it this way. We have three 12 minute stations. One, two, three. Each 12 minute station is a 20 second format. In the case of the first two here, you're gonna work for 20 seconds, rest for 20. Work for 20, rest for 20. Where in the case of the third station here, work for 20, work for 20, rest 20. So in a sense, you're working 20 seconds on, 20 seconds off over here. 40 seconds on, alternating between two different exercises, and 20 seconds off, so 40-20. Rotating through each one of these for 12 minutes. Now, when you set your interval timer, think of it this way, super simple. If we're dealing with 12 minutes, all right, there are three 20-minute segments in every 12-minute period, hence we have 36 intervals on the clock. I don't like, when I set the clock at the gym, I do not set rest. I just set intervals like in other words if I wanted to incorporate um, 30 seconds of work 30 seconds of rest or okay into it with a rest setting then I would have half of these intervals but because I'm just using straight intervals and if this is I hope this isn't confusing things and for me it's the easier way to think about it 36 okay three times 12 there we go okay first station I'm gonna alternate between snatches five right Rest for 20 seconds. Next 20 seconds, as many burpees as I can get and be as consistent as you can with how many burpees you're gonna do. In this format in particular, do like the best burpees you can, all right? Because you could get five, even four, and like, but if you're doing them really well, that's gonna be more than, more than sufficient. Yes, if you're fast at burpees and you do really good burpees, you could still get like six, okay? But be as consistent as you can. So it's gonna be five right, either a kettlebell or dumbbell snatch. Rest for 20 seconds. Burpees. The modification for burpees to people that struggle, if you have a slam ball at home or something you can slam, you can replace burpees with slams. That's a modification, okay? Um, for the snatch. If you're gonna do a kettlebell snatch, it's a little bit trickier, all right? For those of you that are proficient at it, it's fine. If you got a dumbbell, I'll show that. But the kettlebell snatch, I'm gonna draw it back. And what I do is I kind of punch my hand through the top. Bring it back down and then repeat. For five reps. Then I would do my burpees, okay? Following 20 seconds worth of work, I'm doing a snatch on the opposite side. So snatches right, rest, burpees. Snatches left, rest, burpees, etc. Second station, 20 seconds of a clean and squat. Now the modification for the clean and squat, particularly if you've got elbow issues, if the cleans are too much for you, is going to be a goblet squat. That'll be your modification. The modifications for deck squats at this station are gonna be step ups. I wanna get more movement, and sometimes I think people get kind of hung up on the sit and grabs. Think more pace, okay? So, kettlebell clean and squat. I meant to, you guys know the dumbbell snatch, I don't need to show it for that last station. Um, Clean it, squat it, and repeat. I'm gonna stay all on the same side this entire 20 seconds. I'll then do my deck squats or step ups, and then I'm gonna hit the left side the following 20 seconds, okay? Um, last station. So this one here, we're gonna transition from FLR, the first 20, directly into sit-ups, the second 20, then your rest. From there, FLR, into a lever hold, into your rest. So, grab this for the lever hold. So FLR to sit-ups. FLR, I'm gonna hold, because I'm only here for 20 seconds, I'm gonna hold the best one I can, keep my midsection engaged, no hips dropping, okay? Hands stacked under my shoulders. Boop, beep, buzzer goes off. Hands inside of knees, as many sit-ups as I can. Beep, buzzer goes off, I'm resting. So the next 20 seconds, 
Beep, I'm holding FLR. Beep, I'm grabbing my weight, rolling over, arms and legs extended, both off the ground, neither hitting the ground. I'm gonna hold this position until the clock goes off again. Beep, I'm done. Now I rest and I get right back right into FLR again. So I'm gonna alternate. FLR sit-ups, FLR level hold, always followed by 20 seconds of rest after each, okay? This is boom, 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 boom. It's gonna keep moving, it's gonna keep moving. So you gotta be ready to go. The clock waits for no one. Remember, 36 intervals, this will be a great workout. I'm looking forward to it. 8 a.m. tomorrow, if you're available, if you're free, we'll be here, okay? All right, guys, see you tomorrow.